Well, as we've reported before, there are so many folks that are out there making masks, uh, trying to pitch in with a local health effort and uh, gearing those towards health care workers in the area. And that includes one Siouxland woman. That's right. Sophie Heineman talks with the Rock Rapids woman who wasn't quite done helping out some health care workers. When the COVID-19 pandemic hit Kelloland, Linda Sylvie jumped into action. She made more than 400 masks for people in need and is now doing another good deed. And so from the scraps of those masks, I, uh, then I made a quilt. But it went a little further. I thought, you know, there's some heroes out there that need a thank you. Embroidered on the quilt is thank you to our healthcare heroes. It's hanging in the Sanford Clinic right now, but I do plan to share it throughout the community um, from uh, different health facilities to the ambulance garage, the nursing homes. April DeWitt is the RN care manager for Sanford and Rock Rapids, where the quilt is currently hanging. But it's fun to just see the quilt hanging there and recognizing many of those um, patterns from masks that we handed out to patients. Sylvie even recorded a song about the quilt, getting the idea from Dolly Parton's song, Coat of Many Colors. And the lyrics, just mesh so well with the quilt of many colors and so i i made up this song and i actually I, i'm not a i'm not a very good singer but anyway i i like to say just i sing from my heart i sewed cathedral windows from all the scraps of mass and tried to thank our heroes putting their lives at risk Sylvie doesn't take all the credit, though. In fact, she says this act of kindness isn't meant to be about her at all. I um, put the work into it, but it's not about me. It's about those who risk their lives every day to help people with the virus. Everybody was so overwhelmed with the things that were being taken away and wanting to focus on what we were losing, but um, having some perspective to be able to look back and realize that even though this was hard, we were able to make it through that and, and we're still coming out on this end and continuing to fight this pandemic together.